Sellout crowd at Texas Stadium. Over 60,000 to see the 1-1 Eagles take on the 1-1 Dallas Cowboys. Look at the humidity. It's 76% here in Big D. Good field position on the Cowboy 47. Byers on a quick opener, and Byers gets inside the 40-yard line. The top rushing running back last year for the Eagles, number 23, has come in. And a play fake, McMahon, they freeze the defense. Here's the pass downfield, double coverage, and it's knocked away. Schuler is in as a second tight end for the Eagles, and they'll put both Keith Jackson and Byers wide to the right, along with Calvin Williams. McMahon in trouble. Directing traffic, and McMahon is going to get a first down as he slides inside the 25-yard line. They don't have that luxury. First down and 10 with just under eight minutes remaining in the first quarter. Here comes a blitz and the pitch to Byers. And the Eagles thought they might have something against the on-rushing Dallas defense. but Third down and 12. Again, Jackson, Byers, and Calvin Williams, who now goes in motion wide to the right. And the swing pass is out to Sanders. He's got open field and a first down as he's upended inside the 15-yard line. He plays here today. Second down and eight on the 11-yard line. Rookie James Joseph, number 32, checks into the game. McMahon is going for Barnett. He's got a touchdown, Eagles. As Barnett beat Isaac Holt for an 11-yard touchdown strike. And Philadelphia leads it 6 to nothing. Third down and 11. Aikman getting pressure again from behind. Simmons gets in, and a big loss that time as Clyde Simmons picks up a sack and a loss of eight yards. Mike Saxon gets it off. Rod Harris goes way back. Great kick by Saxon. Boy, that is a huge kick. And Harris has just two men to beat, including the kicker, and coming in from behind to make the tackle is Vincent Smith. They don't joke anymore. Dallas needs some beef, but they've improved defensively. First down on the 46-yard line of the Cowboys. McMahon's pass. And did he have possession? He did. That is the end of the first quarter here at Texas Stadium with the score. The Philadelphia Eagles 7 and the Dallas Cowboys nothing. Third down and 12 on the Cowboy 25. And a bootleg. McMahon going wide open in the end zone. And Calvin Williams had beaten his man. Kenneth Gant. Roger Ruzek will attempt a 42-yard field goal. He's already kicked one from 47 yards, and the kick is long enough, and it is good. So the Eagles, who have had two drives started in Dallas territory, have scored twice. And on the second play of the second quarter, Philadelphia 10 and Dallas nothing. Third down and 12. Three wide receivers. Aikman going up on top. The receiver wasn't looking, and the pass is intercepted. Alexander Wright did not see the ball in the air, and Rich Miano, the former New York Jet, picks it off at the 40-yard line. Second down and 15. Maybe they can just ask him to take the mask off. <laughs> it's becoming a popular piece of equipment around the league. You ask him. <laughs> McMahon has time, and his pass is caught by Barnett, and he may have a first down. First and 10. Here's Heath Sherman. Byers trying to block in front, and he is knocked back into Heath Sherman. And he'll lose a yard, and there's a penalty marker down. Holding, number 88 of the offense, 10 yards, still first down. You had a look at Russell Maryland, the number one draft pick from Miami. First down and 20. Fred Barnett makes the catch, and Vincent Smith, who was a plan B pickup from the Pittsburgh Steelers last year, making a terrific play. Second down and 12. Just shy of midfield for the Eagles, and we'll have penalty markers here as McMahon may have a free play, and the pass to Calvin Barnett is knocked away by Isaac Holt. That was Calvin Williams. Offside, right side of the defense, five yards, still second down. 9.40 remaining in the first half. Jackson and he'll have the first down for the Eagles. Plenty of time for McMahon and throwing high again intended for Barnett. Second down and 
10. McMahon, penalty marker, throw. And McMahon scampers to the 31 yard line. Back up. Number 78 of the offense, 10 yards. Here's the rookie. Still second down. Second down and 20. The Eagles push back to midfield and we'll have another penalty marker. It should be a, on the defense as Mickey Schuler, the second tight end, gets free. And it's inside the 35. Shy of a first down. Starting from inside the two yard line, Aikman in trouble. I don't know how he escaped that rush and his pass is thrown away. Second down and five. Smith, who gained only four yards, brings it out for the first down. 545 remaining in the half. Aikman looking up the middle, and that pass is intercepted by Joyner. And there's the guy you were talking about. Joyner covering Novacek, the tight end, and Seth Joyner picks off the interception, and it's his first second of the season. Go in the first half. on another high pass and the ball was stripped away by Hendricks and the Cowboys are claiming that they've got possession and apparently they're going to rule it an incompleted pass Aikman lets it go in a hurry and the pass is picked off the third interception of the game and Rich Miano has his second so the Eagles are really putting the heat on Troy Aikman today, and Rich Miano has two of the three Eagle interceptions, and they'll get good field position yet again. Same results as the Eagles have found in the last couple of seasons against Jimmy Johnson's team, however. Second and ten. McMahon has time. He's going deep for Barnett. And Barnett makes the catch at the one-yard line with Manny Hendricks all over him and a gain of 44. McMahon coming back to prove that he can still put that ball deep right here. Dissecting it right down the middle. It'll be on the left side of your screen. Watch Barnett go up. Hendricks right over his shoulder. But Barnett able to reach it and then hang on to it as he rolls into the end zone. Fred Barnett already has caught six passes for 99 yards, including a touchdown reception. And a first and goal on the one. And Drummond is in for the score. Robert Drummond and the Eagles have silenced this capacity crowd. The Cowboys have their best starting field position of the game. That doesn't do them any good as Aikman goes down. That's the fifth sack of the game by Philadelphia. And Mike Golick gets into the column. A loss of eight yards. Complete defensive end. Plays the run first and then rushes the passer. Aikman sacked again. Back to the 25-yard line, and the clock stops with 11 seconds to go. And this is a no contest. They ought to call this one off. And at the end of the first half, the score, the Eagles 17 and the Cowboys nothing. He has sure not had much effectiveness against this Philadelphia Eagle defense. Third and eight from the goal line, and Aikman. Yeah, and let's fumble. see if it'll be a fumble. You bet it will. Or an incompleted pass. It is a fumble. The arm was going forward. Clyde Simmons got a piece of it. Jeff Eagles holding a 55-yard attempt for Ruzek, who is yet to miss this year. A boomer. It's long enough, and the kick is no good. It's off to the left. And the Cowboys have suffered according to Second down and nine. Aikman in trouble. And that'll be sack number eight by the Philadelphia Eagles. And Clyde Simmons has established an Eagle record. That is his fifth sack of the game. Clyde Simmons will keep this tape and play it over and over again <laughs> for his grandchildren. A chance to watch Clyde Simmons here as he just gets around and blows to the inside. Lined up very tight here. Just around on 2 and A. Throws him outside and then goes right back underneath. But Aikman's got to get rid of that football. He's hanging on to the football and paying the price for it. Third down and 12, and Aikman under pressure again and goes down again, and the Eagles have tied a club record with nine sacks in a game, and Mike Golick has two. Eric Shepard to return. Eagles gets off a of beauty. Shepard falls down, and the ball takes a big Philadelphia bounce, and nothing goes 
right for the Dallas Cowboys today. They have a first down now. Aikman, and they're pushing the line into his face again. And the pass incomplete. Penalty marker down. And we may have a roughing the passer. Roughing the passer. Number 59 of the defense. And it's Seth Joyner, the linebacker. Will continue after this message from your local station. You're watching the NFL. Second down and 17 on the Cowboy 29. Aikman hanging in there, and the pass is batted by Reggie White. Back into Aikman's hands. So he caught his own pass. <laughs> We've seen both quarterbacks receive their own passes today. Fields it and loses possession, and Dallas picks it up inside the five. <laughs> Kenneth Gant, and there's a break for the Dallas Cowboy. All day. And here comes a pass, and Reggie White came in unmolested. No one picked him up. And that is the 10th sack of the game by the Eagles and a loss of nine back to the 20. And Reggie White with his first sack, a new Philadelphia record of 10. Number 92, Reggie White. And watch him, not fooled at all by the play action. He's going to fly right around Nate Newton. Watch him right here. Aikman thinking he could get that quick roll, a little bootleg against the grain. But Reggie anticipating a trick play came upfield very quickly and celebrates the sack. Ten sacks and losses of 58 yards today. Tremendous front line effort. It's third down and 18. And a fumble. Philadelphia has it. They try to lateral it. It's going to be Eagles ball. These are the numbers when they look at the stats and the tapes. The sacks today, 11 in all, led by Clyde Simmons with a club record four and a half sacks in one game. Bruce Colley was the guard who was guilty of the false start. Here comes the blitz. McMahon going on a fade and the pass. And, and there'll be a penalty. Pass interference against Manny Hendricks. You see Hendricks number 45 right there with the bump clearly ahead of the ball. It would be hard for me to point to anything to make those coaches smile on the far sideline. Second and goal on the six. McMahon. Pass caught. Oh, and Byers, does he get in? Yes, wow. touchdown. Philadelphia, that was sheer strength on the part of Keith Byers. And a touchdown for him. His second of the year as a receiver. A post-game show coming up. There's a fade pattern and incomplete. The pass was intended for Alexander Wright, and covering was Ben Smith. I guess the thing that would embarrass you even more than the score and the way this game was played, if you're a Cowboy, is that you played it at home. Philadelphia defense, simply the story. Fred Barnett bought a touchdown pass. Robert Drummond had a score, and so did Keith Byers. So for Merlin Olsen, this is Dick Stockton saying so long from Texas Stadium. 24-0 the final.